Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Angelie here, what it do? And today you guys, I'm coming at you with a fashion to figure haul. So if you would like to see the things that I got, then keep on watching. Okay. Alright you guys, so today's fashion to figure haul was solely prompted by the new boot release from Nadia with fashion to figure. We have a fashion to figure here locally, however, they have been closed since the pandemic, so I have not been able to go into the store. Fashion to figure is one of those stores where for me personally, I need to go in that store and try on my clothes because some things is just, I'm in between on some things. Some things I need a one, some things I need a three. So... That's just how I am with fashion to figure. And when it comes to shoes, I really prefer to try my shoes on because my foot size is all over the place. In um, most stores, like for kids, when I buy tennis shoes, I know what size I wear in tennis shoes, no problem. But boots and sandals and things like that, I'm typically somewhere around a nine. I might be an eight and a half, I might be a nine, I might be a nine and a half, I might be a ten. It all depends on how the shoe is made. So that's why I really prefer to go in. But since the store is closed, and at this point, y'all, it's looking like the store is not even going to reopen at this point. But anywho, let's talk about it. The first thing that I got is this, it's really nice on y'all this ruched blouse I like the way it looks on y'all just got on a pair of crop leggings from Torrid size one these are life y'all I love these anyway this blouse is so cute on however I don't like the feel of the material it's like a silky polyester -y feel but y'all, this is, this is so cute. Does the ruching work? Well, the string does. Yeah, you can make it as short or as long as you would like. That's cool to know that this is functional. And just tie that back. Okay. So, I guess you're supposed to wear it like up on your shoulder like this. Okay, you can wear it like that. It covers up everything. Or I guess you can pull it down some. Let's see how it looks. If you pull it. I like it. Get it together, Angel Girl. Okay. Pull our straps down. What do you think like this? I think if I was to wear it, I would have to wear it like this because when I have it up on my shoulder, I feel like the sleeve is, it just hits me in an awkward place. And it has like this really, really good rubber right here around the, around the wrist. And it just hits me in an awkward place. So to make the sleeves a little longer, I would just pull it down like that. This is cute, right? Get into it. This is how it looks in the back. It's ruched in the back as well. This is stunning. The It's like a silky, silky polyester feel. I like this though. What do y'all think? What do you think? It's cute. All right, you guys, so next are the Nadia boots. This is how they come in a black, like, um, linen bag like this. I got the chocolate. Okay. Okay, let's just kick that over. All right, you guys, I got the chocolate ones. And this is how they look. I 
This is the back. Okay, it has the strings right here, and this is adjustable. This is the inside. Got it. Let me take that out. We'll take that out in a moment. And this is the front of the boot. Here's the heel. The heel is not too high, which is a great thing for me because you know your girl is not a heel wearer. The bottom. Now one thing, y'all might have been through some things. It looked like it has like scratches and white marks. These boots were $129, which I don't mind, but I don't know what these white marks are on mine. I mean, I don't mind the money. I'll pay for whatever I want, but for some shoes that I'm not even going to wear like that, they better be perfect. Okay. Because y'all know I'm not really a boot girl. But one, what I can say about these is they are thigh high. Y'all, what's up with my boot? Like, let's not be picky, but what is that? And it's like white marks. I don't know if y'all can see. Take my word for it, y'all. It's marks on the boot. But, nevertheless, let's put it on. Okay. But while I'm taking this out, what I can say is it looks like it will fit these big old hand bone thighs of mine. So, I can appreciate that about these. I got these in a size 9 wide. I just... I thought a 10 would be too big and I don't think they had half sizes so I went with the 9 so let's put these on okay all right you guys so I have them on and what do you think here we are from the front the side the back The other side and here they are on the inside now what I can say is I did not adjust these at all I just put them on and they stay on these big old hand bones of mine like my thighs are huge and they are on there however y'all do they look too slouchy I feel like when I saw Nadia's, hers were not in the commercial. Hers were not this slouchy. I think. And then I feel like mine are like a half a size too big. Because my foot is moving around in it. And I don't like that. But again, I don't believe they offer half sizes. But I think I got too much. Too much room here what do y'all think now I can say what I can say is that these are comfortable they don't have any um memory foam or anything like that inside of them but these are uber comfortable and that's for somebody who hardly ever wears heels if I wear heels I wear them from my house to my car, from my car to the place, to the place to sit down and back again. Okay? So, what do you think with this little top? And if I was to wear it, it would be just like this. <laughs> could I wear this to work? I could. Will I? Not a man day. Like, <laughs> no. 
my life is too casual for this. But I could. What do you think? Um, I'm just not crazy about all the room that I have in these. Like I said, they are comfortable though, but of all the times, now they want to cut their grass. <sighs> Excuse them. Anyway, um, let me know what you think. They did have other colors and other patterns but I thought the chocolate was it was good it was a different change for myself I really like the color and everything I like the toe is pointy without being like overly pointy like I can't stand a, a super sharp pointy toe shoe I feel like it makes my foot look bigger than it already is you, you see what I'm saying but yeah. What do you think? Let me know. I don't think I'm going to keep them because, like I said, the fact that my foot is moving around in them, that will annoy the mess out of me. And I just have these on with a pair of um, no-show black socks. I wear those every day of my life. So, yeah. But this is that. All right, you guys, to go with the boots, I also got this 3 4th um, length, like, everyday midi dress. So, this is the thing, y'all. I got this in a size 2 because, like I said, I'm uh, iffy. I still got my pants on, y'all. But the 2 is it's too big for me. It's not doing what I needed to do, so I need a size 1. But, and then it's too, it's too much room down here at the bottom. Anyway, like I thought it was, I needed it to be tighter. But anyway, what I was going to do with this is just roll it anyway. You get my drift but I was just gonna roll it and make it you know a short and wear it with the boots like what do you think but it's too much it's too much room it's not as snug as I want it to be but these don't have colors on it so this is like a rust color I don't know it's looking a little a little ready on camera on my monitor but this is like a rust color I love the feel of it I love the neckline and everything this is a nice basic like I said it's an everyday dress it's just that I have the wrong size now I bought two of these I don't know why I thought I got this in brown but clearly I didn't I got the exact same dress in orange a size 2 I'm not going to try this on because basically they're they're so similar in color and it's the exact same dress just in orange all right you guys so that concludes my really quick fashion to figure haul like I said I really wish I could have went in the store because I wanted to get some more jeans and things like that but I'm going to try one more time, y'all. I'm going to try one more time and see if the store is open in the mall. If not, I'll just order some online. It's no biggie. But if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. I love you guys so very much for watching. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.